It's the cell phone video that rocked the city of Athens, a large brawl inside Athens High School that started when a mom became angry and ended with four arrests. In about an hour and a half, a community meeting will be held in Athens to bring all sides together. Way 31's Alexis Scott shows us who organized the event and what they hope to accomplish. I'm standing right outside the Tank Beaver's gym here at the Athens Boys and Girls Club. The staff here is expecting dozens of people to come out and talk through their frustrations. The director told me that he hopes that young adults and police can really understand each other after what happened last week. You know, right now we're living in a, a time where um, there's not a lot of respect for authority, and I think that's, what, that's a big part of the problem. Yeah. Dwayne LaRue is the director of the Boys and Girls Club of Athens. He told me after last week's fight inside Athens High School, where an adult and three students were arrested, he wanted to do something about it. So he talked with Athens police and decided to have an open discussion about change and the way people view officers and their actions. Everybody is quick to point the finger and blame others, but sometimes you got to take that look in the mirror. But I think it starts with us. LaRue told me many young people don't know how to behave around authority, so they need to be taught how. How would you know if they're unapproachable if you don't effectively communicate with them? Jared Collier volunteers at the Boys and Girls Club. He says some students are still hurt by last week's events. No matter you know, how many days have passed, there's still those images. So I do believe that um, this right here will kind of ease everyone's pain. Collier told me he hopes people come out and hear what people on both sides have to say, including police. Show how we can pull it together. I think that it could, it could help a lot of people get closure, uh, help a lot of people understand both sides better. At the meeting tonight, LaRue told me that they will not be discussing any specific details from what happened last week. He said he wants to keep the focus on solutions to keep that situation from ever happening again. Reporting in Athens, Alexis Scott, Way 31 News. Tonight's meeting starts at 6. The public is invited. We have a crew there and we'll bring you updates on Way 31 News tonight at 10 and online.